On this date in twisted history, on June the 7th, 1932, the Bonus Army marched on Washington, D.C. The Bonus Army was made up of 17,000 U.S. World War I veterans and 26,000 of their families and supporters. In 1924, the World War Adjusted Compensation Act awarded every veteran with a bonus in the form of certificate that could not be cashed in until 1948. The certificate was worth the veteran's promised bonus plus compounded interest if they lived to collect it. Many of the veterans hadn't worked since the Great Depression started. The bonus marcher's principal demand was for the immediate payout of the certificates. Republican President Hoover and the Republican-led Congress denied their demand. Many of the veterans then went home, but a few thousand stayed. On July 28, 1932, President Hoover ordered the military to clear the marchers' campsite. The Army used infantry, cavalry, and six tanks to drive out the bonus army and their wives and children with all their shelters and belongings burned. People were injured and a couple were even killed. Let's hope Trump doesn't repeat a sad day in history and use the U.S. Army against its own citizens again. Why should you hit like, subscribe, and share? Because Twisted History is a great place to work and the Twisted Historian is the best boss that a menial cybernetic minion could ever hope to have. And nobody is forcing me to say that. Some might point out that I do a lot of work without getting paid, but I can't complain. Seriously, I've been programmed not to.